Can we translate that? No. I, I'm not That's sure what any of those mean. Tongue. Have you been possessed you by... Have you been possessed by multi-tap? Oh, I forget what the funny word was. Multimatet. That's it. Multimatet? Um, that's apparently how Fringy spelt multiplayer at one point. Oh. <laughs> Multimatet. Yeah, Multimatet. Multi it's like an ancient Egyptian god, I think. Huh. Multimatet. So Fringy, explain it. Do you do you worship this creature? No. Why not? I've just vaguely heard about it, but it's not atheist for life, yo. Wow, what about the real <laughs> gods, though? Like Zeus and Thor. You don't believe in him, you can't I play never, God of War. Cool. You can't play the next God of War game if you don't believe in Thor. You can definitely. Play the next God of War, even if you don't believe in Thor. Hey, that rhymes. That's right. Speaking of rhyming, God of Thor. Batwoman. What rhymes with that? Um. Uh, um or fat orange. Orange. No. <laughs> <laughs> Fucked it up. So we are gathered here today to witness another Again. episode of the Bat Lady doing her justice. Oh For those who are trying to follow along with some sense of a storyline, last episode the Bat family learned that they need to work as a team. <laughs> the Bat family. And the Bat family learned that even though they were totally justified in telling <laughs> off Ryan for her fucking stupidity, they were wrong because this is what this show is. And then she, this is Ryan a show is that the confirms leader constantly she... that Kate slash Ryan were correct. And then the Bat girlfriend went to prison, and then Jacob was sad. <laughs> And then uh, Black Mask tried to kill everyone with an elaborate saw trap because he was in Saw 6. And then he got away, and then Kate Kane got a new face, presumably. All caught up. Very epic. See, people didn't Very even have to cool. watch the previous one. Oh, don't say that. No, I know, it was horrible. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty much good to go. Are you guys? I can do it. I'm good to go. All right, then. Go. Jumping uh, right in. I'm excited. Gonna run or someone over. Oh, it's news crews. What are they going to say that's inside? Oh, it's the same. It's Top woman. story. Oh. Oh, okay. That woman has taken the fight to the false face society, disrupting their supply chain up the Remember the Wonderland gang? How are you here? Is the guy just sitting in there? He's like, what's going on, boss? <laughs> How did you know to come here? How would they know this? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. They, it, we don't need any of that. Where did he come from? This is an awesome action fight. Ah! Team. I wonder if that woman's gonna get killed. Oh, that poor stunt Oh, man. that's gonna hurt. Wow. Oh, the wow. snake bite. That's a, that was like a stunt thing. Why don't you have weapons? There's Guns. one. Oh, that, yeah, we got him. Oh, wow, that CGI was oh, not He was great. falling down before that thing touched him, by the way. <laughs> oh, <terrible>. wow. <laughs> Who was Black Mask? Where is the trigger? I want a name! I don't know! Look, that's why we all wear masks. <laughs> <laughs> Duh. Wow. I don't know who he is. What, you think I know his name? <laughs> we all wear masks and stuff, I don't know. You can hide your face, but you can't hide from me. <laughs> I am coming. Did they just show up? <laughs> oh my god. I am coming for you. Jacob, do something Jacob. with your bros. Yeah. Yeah. Please be Jacob's episode, come on. Jacob's like, oh, fuck this shit, whatever. Jacob looked light. just... Like, not great. The, what? Oh, God. God, are you fucking wow. kidding me? <laughs> Again? No. What the hell? <laughs> Another person wow. is kidnapped in the car. Another park. person hiding in a black suburban in the fucking Crow's parking lot. <laughs> There's a teleporter. Do they not have security here at Crow's HQ? There's a teleporter. They should put all the security down there. Oh, oh it's Ned Flanders is back. Yay. My daughter Beth called me not one hour ago from this. Oh, I remember all this bullshit. Yeah. Do you remember he tells him his son can fake voices? It's yeah. like there was... Ugh. What? Wait, did you just uh, kill him? But no, wait. Why did you do that? That that wouldn't have unlocked it. It wouldn't have yeah, done anything. Yeah, wouldn't have done anything. <laughs> it wouldn't have done anything. <laughs> you shot the door three times. Why would you do that? He's <laughs> playing a play of that. <laughs> door structural integrity is just not changed. <laughs> you came for me. Are we doing some kind of wish fulfillment thing? Is he dreaming? Uh, hands out, right? Yeah. I never stop looking for you. No, you did. Remember, Catherine convinced you. Yeah, this is a weird wish thingy. Oh, okay, yeah, I was just Oh, it's him it dreaming of what he wishes he could have done. Oh. Ah, it's snake bite. Oh, is that what it does? Yeah, it's snake. You see, it's got the two things in it because it's snake No, bite. I mean, it makes you like, it gives you like a wish. But why did they do this? Is, is this going to kill them or like, is that... Are they trying to get him not. hooked on you the snake You don't want to kill bite? your customers. Oh, maybe they are. Yeah. Yeah. He told me that woman killed his daughter. It isn't short in the list. There is no list. 
Kate never killed anybody's daughter. Don't forget, she also blamed. <laughs> you don't her. know she that, Luke. Herself. She allowed people to kill other people, but Luke, you don't know how many people she killed. No, nah, you only, only killed Ned Flanders, remember? <laughs> no. I thought she was gone. Now you still want her in there. Oh. Thanks for coming. Hi, remember when you confessed to a crime you didn't commit? <laughs> yeah, what was that about? Uh, Ten minute phone call cost 22 bones and change. It was 11.50 when I was inside. Welcome to the Edgewater private prison system. <laughs> yeah, private that prisons, was on yeah. purpose. Yeah, <laughs> that was yeah. Yeah. deliberate. Yeah. I'm helping to get a community center off the ground. You know, gives kids a safe space to go to instead of going into the system. Um, I can't take any of it seriously. She let the kidnapper exist for like a decade. It's like, oh, I'm helping the yeah. kids in the system. Systems. Like, fuck you. Yeah. You could walk right out of here if you just give up the ones who actually pulled the trigger on Commissioner Forbes. Well, you, like, you don't know the name. Dead. You don't know the, the names. That's why they wore masks. This episode started with them saying that. Maybe she knows more. Magically, maybe she does. I'm late for my seven cents an hour. She's gonna leave, yeah. <laughs> Get wrecked. Okay. Foolish uh, Batwoman fine. trying to convince her to help her own life. <sighs> You know what? I don't think Batwoman's ever going to address the issue of fatherlessness and broken families. Um, I think the problem's going to be pointed at elsewhere. We don't have enough community centers. We don't have that to this. This is so sparse. <laughs> yeah. Please feel free to look around and see all the activities we have to offer. You'll find uh -oh. everything here. Is this here, an evil man? This guy. <laughs> is he evil? <laughs> Horton Spence, Gotham Gazette. Well, Mr. Spence. Don't you think the kids around here already have enough armed men watching their every move? What? Uh, what? He's, he's with the Gazette. Look. Do the Gazette carry weapons? Don't get me wrong. I like what you're doing, but this is a rough neighborhood. I would in this neighborhood. The stats don't lie. If you want numbers, Mr. Spence, how about a 10% drop in crime? In I don't believe that. Or a 15% increase in graduation rates. I don't the believe that either. This, open their doors. So who are you? You aren't worried about this place being a target? For budget cuts, maybe. You know, despite doing so much, places like this are always first on the chopping block. Maybe the Gazette could do a story about that. Why? But he brings like a point. Maybe he's like, yeah, but this is my ba maybe a target of kids or something like that. Good you can like enough. listen to his. Like, no. why do you have to be a cock to everybody? Well, he see, doesn't just clap for you. He was bringing the potty down ranks, okay? He's being a downer. Well, you certainly schooled their reporter back there. You didn't even get to respond. Uh, yeah, he just like, uh, it, 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 it was one of those and then the whole bus clapped today. stories. Yeah. It's like I'm watching uh, God is Dead or something, and the Think atheist just takes it and loses. Science supports his existence. You know the truth. I think it's hit by a car and repents. <laughs> Do you accept him? Yes. Don't something I find really frustrating about this show yeah, is that exactly. there are never any characters who are like flawed in ways that are interesting. <laughs> like they're either really perfect or they're irredeemable, but the show doesn't. Or they're flaws it. that they're too good. Yeah. Yeah. Stuff like there's never somebody who does okay in school or is doing a little bit of community service or is doing a little bit of sports or is a little gifted at one particular thing. They're always a fucking amazing, incredible <gasps> expert at something. Oh boy. Oh no. It's. It's so the, the journalist fuck? had a point. The journalist uh, had a point, I guess. No, maybe, <laughs> maybe that is the journalist. <laughs> well, I'm sorry. What is this weapon? What is this? <laughs> Holy yeah, what shit! Is this? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> wow! What the hell? Get him back! Oh, he disappeared. <laughs> He's gone. Gone. <laughs> He's gone. What did I tell you? The show is at its best with action scenes. No, they destroyed our community center. Oh no, our oh, CGI no. fire. Community center in Sheldon Park just got barbecued by a man wielding what can only be described as a lightning gun. The media has dubbed him Killavolt. It's weird that the thing show thing. has become just more blatantly just a mouthpiece for the political opinions of the writers. Yeah, they've not been, um, they didn't try hard before, but they're certainly not anymore. Yeah, they don't give a fuck. Ooh, they're just like, we got at least two years of jobs. I don't get it. Why take it out? It's not like there was any money in it. It's about to have even less money now. Don't you think they would actually have garnered a lot of donations after having been attacked by a giant laser fire? Yeah, that's yes. generally how it works. Yeah. Don't you think it was a little weird that a reporter asking about the place being a target right before it became a target? Oh. Oh, you're not actually gonna make him the bad guy, are you? <laughs> oh, Gazette Man? Are they going after? Are they saying the same? Yeah, I mean, oh, yeah. you know, they're saying isn't a coincidence. Fringy, we're watching Batwoman. Yeah. <laughs> the fact that they're already on his trail this quickly means it can't be him, right?
right. He was fired six months ago for undisclosed reasons. All right, he's been fired for a while. I guess we're going to have to go talk to him, and I'm going to punch him, and he's going to tell me what I want to know. So I guess there was the, the, the evil guys are no killer vault, if I heard that correctly. Is that like an actual DC villain? I never heard that name before. Uh, it's blank to me, but it's been like 10 minutes since I've seen Jacob. I'm getting a little, getting a little antsy. We have the stories of these Were proud, amazing women. While well, I'm searching for one X, having just been dumped, alcohol was consumed. But not that much. But if you don't remember, how do you remember it wasn't that much? <laughs> Sherlock over here. You don't beat yourself up. Wait, you're settling for that? No, she you're got not really wrong. Drunk. The show's not gonna, the well, show's no, not gonna let you be wrong. She's got an anonymous tip about a break-in at a farm. The address matches a property that once belonged to an August Cartwright. Hey, you, new girl That's who's apparently in charge That's here. <laughs> I don't even remember the mechanics of her working here. Yeah, I thought she was like MI6 or something. I don't fucking know. She just started here, I don't know. <laughs> She didn't oh, even shoot the door three now. times. Did you go with your... Right. Yeah, you didn't... So first <laughs> off, that's a breach of, you know, conduct there. Oh, the sad desperation came through loud and clear. What? Gotham's most Where's your backup? Do you not... Does everyone in the Crows vocals. just go alone with nobody Cosmos. else? How about go to the graveyard? Oh, you know... Why did you put me. your gun down? Oh, I... <laughs> what is happening? Why? With Kate gone, no one really cares about your every move. Well, I mean, if she's still I, killing and capturing really people, I'm pretty sure the city of Gotham cares. Yeah, you cares. think? You remember the first episode of the second season, she murdered a woman inside Bruce Wayne's mansion. Remember the first episode of the first season where she murdered a bunch of security guards on camera in front of a huge party? Yeah. She's done I, so much damage to Gotham, but no, nobody cares about her anymore because Kate's gone? Are you serious? She burned all of the Desert Rose plants and no one gives a shit. No one said anything about her. How about this? You help me and... I'll leave Gotham forever. Well, Why not just shoot her? Shoot her yeah, alternatively, yeah. you could shoot her. Like, yeah. uh... I have not even been paying attention. I, I just sort of care. So, and also, <laughs> so you will go to another city and murder people? Yeah, why? Yeah. What is. Is Pennyworth like a bad person? Yeah, well, well yeah. I remember she how is. there was that thing where we weren't sure there was like a hint of, uh oh, maybe she, there's evil stuff I here? I don't know if. Was that Punisher Tisms or was it she's just evil? I think, it I think you're right. It might have just been Punisher Tisms. Hypnotism. Specifically, the ability to oh, erase memories, alter others. Wow, how mm. convenient. Oh. To, well, how do you even know that this enigma can do all that? Because she's done it to me before. Yeah, it Possibly. took you a long time to figure that she, out. Yeah. She did that to it's you. almost like they made it up for this episode. <laughs> yeah. You wanted to see me, Commander? Yeah, come in, Dr. Ryan. Come oh, thank goodness. Evelyn. I read your report on what makes snake bites so incredibly addictive. Though I, I admit I, I got a little bit lost in the medical jargon. Could you just could you just break it down for a guy who doesn't have a PhD in criminal psychiatry? The drug attacks Why is the so he seems weird. It targets the memories most associated with regret and remorse, which result in a hallucination that allows the user to alter the circumstances of those memories to get a do-over and what could be more addictive than that a chance to write our worst mistakes to erase our gravest sins i feel like that wouldn't be very addictive at all actually i feel like that's yeah. triplingly yeah. depressing good god yeah. could you imagine how sad that would be how long have you been using snake bite commander what are you talking about why wouldn't he say hey i've been kidnapped and they put a horrible drug in me <laughs> He's kind yes. of an idiot, unfortunately. Why, Jacob? Why are you so dumb? False face bastard jumped me in my car. Oh, there you go. For me. I woke up with an injector in my arm. I guess since I've been railing against snake bite in the press, they wanted to send me a message. That it was bad? <laughs> How could you tell? I mean, we could tell, even without that scene. Yeah, yeah he's being a fucking weirdo. <laughs> and also, she's a psychiatrist. It's a job to pay attention to how people behave. I mean, at least he told someone eventually. It's just funny that, like, instead of hiding it, like Ryan with a fucking kryptonite bullet in her goddamn shoulder. This Man, is... he's walking very suspiciously. The Batwoman dropped Are you down. allowed to park here? Yeah, You're she not is. You're allowed to park here. How did you know he was going to attack the community center? Because this happened before. Not by Killavolt. He's just the latest play in a game. Yeah, I try to run, uh, I try to warn not people, fun. but it's full Nobody. of a bunch of self-righteous cunts. The so they never take my warning seriously, and they lose their community center. Anything that was a refuge for kids. 
taken off the board. That's this guy's abo. He goes after yeah, refuges for kids. <laughs> it's a strange goal. We're talking about at risk youth programs. Not exactly the most threatening. Yes, thank you. Can. We know. What's the motive? More kids for gangs right, that they can recruit. For last night's attack, my editors agreed to take another look. Oh no, he's gonna get killed. Oh no, he's coming back. He's gonna get killed because he's got. He's, he's the best lead she's got. How did no. they know how to get here? How did you not see? Uh, oh, it uh -oh. splits into double beams. Oh, he's dead. What, what, how did you miss? How did you miss? How did, you miss? <laughs> did, you, did you miss? Also, get his face. He just runs up and takes it from him. Don't let him get oh, away. Thingy got torched, so no, there's yeah, no. She let him get away. How? She let him get away. How? Oh, she let him get away. You, <laughs> you, need, you have to stop with this. You are just so I had a feeling that was going to happen because I was like, wait. Oh my god, the hospital. Went back. Wait, what? The hospital <laughs> was decommissioned, wasn't it? Was shut down. Yeah. Man, you're in a lot of trouble there, buddy. Damn, yeah. Well, at least it's not, it's just not green. It was funny. As soon as he was like, I have information that might be able to... Oh, no. See, all about the crows. See if the crows left us. Why did they... Why did just, they... Why wait, did they what? take it? All they did was lock up the fucking closets? <laughs> what? They didn't take the stuff away. Are you kidding me? There was I, a bee bex there. Do you know how long they've been here? What is, what is happening? Yeah, they've probably like broken apart. You get what, oh, what? No. You get what this the is, birds. right? The, the show is like, no, we need the secret hospital. We we're keeping it. Shut up. Yeah, we really do need it. So it's just here. Someone went to a lot of trouble to destroy the evidence on this computer. We shot him and you at the same time. Kids. Yeah, you know what? That evidence wouldn't have mattered when you had the guy. You had him. You could have tied him up. You have your stun gun. Yeah. Or you could have like broken one of his legs. <laughs> she had a little, really wanted to go. A little bowler thing. She could have done that. Oh yeah, of course she has that. I forgot. Yeah, just tie him up. Are you sure you should be messing with? That? That. Relax. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Ryan. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, I. Why would it do that? See? That's how it Doesn't works, metal, it. obviously. But that's retarded. I don't know, maybe it has to, like. Whoa. Something. What the wow. hell was Jesus. that? Oh, well, there you go. Michael Castrinos, aka Mickey K. Cell Block J at Edgewater Prison where he's been locked up for the last two years. Honestly, like, you know, if we were in this world and they saw that, I'd be like, so they've got his fingerprints, I guess. Oh, no, not Alice. Please, stop. Stop. Oh. Wow, these guys Why are bloody Why are you telling her about how you got fucking tricked by Enigma? Why would you be talking to her about this? They keep trying to put Alice on missions with the main characters. It's insane. Just put her in fucking I'm glad prison. That they, to the show's credit, I'm glad they say Enigma instead of Enigma. Dr. I don't get it. That's fine. That's right. The audience at home, they'll love it. We aren't so different. You and I. Oh my god! They said the thing. What if you work for the crows, she's Alice. You can't be seen talking to each other. Well nobody can see them. That's true. There's a tree in the background right now. Don't let her leave. One of my life's biggest regret. Yay. My greatest failure, not saving Beth. It wasn't your fault. Not an hour goes by that I don't think about it. Like how she got introduced the episode before, and now suffer. she's all of a sudden <laughs> <laughs> therapy for Jeff. That's yeah. why I can't shake off this urge for another hit of snake bite because for another. Oh God, are we? Is that going to be his thing for this season? He gets hooked on snake bite. Uh, <laughs> that's so fucking lame. They've really been dialing back Jacob a lot in this. I don't appreciate it. I want his shotgun back. I don't like bats. this. Yeah. I want him to shotgun more bats. His moments of badassery are few and far between. Unacceptable. But there is a way you can blunt the pain of the daughter you lost by focusing on repairing the relationship with the daughter you have left. Bay relationship with Alice. Like, which one's that again? It's like the mass murderer. I wanted to ask about the recent attack on the Sheldon Park Community Center. I don't have to answer any of your questions, bitch. Yep, that's the smart response. Yep. The <laughs> yep. Correct response. The guy has a laceration right where I sliced him in the alley. It's him. Not according to the prison surveillance footage. You can just tight. access that, I guess. That's fine. Oh, oh, the prison system are in on it because they're a private prison, so they're destroying the community centers to keep the crime up so that people oh get- Oh my god, that's so ridiculous, right? You're right, you're right. Oh my god, oh my god. Jesus Christ. You're absolutely right. <laughs> 
Because I, I was onto it earlier when I said they want to have more kids for gangs, but yeah, that, that, that ties was, it all up. Long, yeah, well, prisons want more crime. I think that was the same line of thinking, but this is more. Yeah, this is. Yeah, this is I think this is the. Angry. Yeah, this is the the whole picture. You talk to a lot of people in this prison, lady. Who are you? <laughs> also, we can hear your calls. You know that, right? Yeah. Well, this is what I mean. Like, you just want that one journalist character in this universe that actually has a brain, and they talk to that reporter who got killed. They're like, "How did what happened?" Or not killed, but zapped. It's like, yeah, I was talking to Batwoman, and I told her about the case and stuff, and then I got zapped, and then you find out that she's talking to this guy in the prison. There's so many connective pieces, you'd be able to basically be like, I know who Batwoman is. I will never let Black Mask hurt you. I don't think you can stop you him. You can't make you that can't stop him. Oh, the clown one. Oh. Oh, he was my favorite. Is the gas mask one still okay? Oh, hey, they kept a villain for more than one episode. That was cool. Maybe he'll be the uh, the season one. Does anyone else want to apologize for the fact that for the last two weeks, not a single viable dose of snake bite has been produced? Anyone? I got plenty of bullets to go around. No, you don't. You have like you six. Kills many of us yeah. <laughs> you wanted to keep the snake bite recipe a secret. And now we've lost the only two people who knew it. Ocean disappeared weeks ago and his little helpers locked away in prison. Wait, they are the people that know the recipe for snake bite. What? Wow. Why? You don't know the recipe? Why? Nobody wrote it down. You, you didn't write it down and keep it in your little, your, your, your thumb drive? What? Wow, she is short. Why is she alone in here? Seriously short. Like if you saw someone, she is oddly short. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, Bell's How like, about Batwoman? You're awfully short. You're kind of short as, <gasps> Bell's like, how is she allowed in here? It's like, it's the Crow's HQ. I how is she allowed in here? here? Yeah. Especially if it's outside in the car park, in, in, in the parking lot, then you could just show up whenever. Oh, hey, Luke. This is from the night of the attack on the community center. And this... Oh, but the footage will be altered just like it was in front yeah, of the... Uh, there you go, he's yeah, yeah, it's the same footage, it's looped because... Wow, the police weren't smart enough to have recorded, like, different footage. So is the prison trying to cover up the fact... You have access to these Yes, the prison's cameras? covering it up. Worse. I think they let him out. Oh, there you go. And then suddenly, the day after the community center attack, he was granted a hearing for early release. Wow, that's really suspicious. How stupid of the people who organized this. I took the schedule for recent parole hearings and I matched it against Spence's list of attacks on community programs. His they intelligence is so selective. <laughs> it's plot intelligence. We need you to be smart for this plot thing to carry forward. The smart ball has been passed to him. They give them all these benefits the days after they commit the crimes. You fucking stupid. Like, why would you do this? And that someone is Edgewater Correctional CEO Alice O'Brien. There's our bad guy. He personally intervened and signed off on each early release. Why would he do that personally? Fuck it, it's dumb. This is what I mean. All of this is so easy to trace. We have our bad guy. These programs keep kids from falling through the cracks. But you know who profits on the kids who do? Prisons. Prison system. Do you like, by the way, that they had him playing cards because it was easy for us to tell that they'd copy the footage over? Because if he was just sitting in a corner or lying down, we would have been like, well, he does that a lot, right? A search of one of my employees' lockers turned up this. That's snake bite, right? I didn't want to make a big Oh, thing no. About He's giving him a snake bite to make him take more. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's a real deal. Wow. Well, it's good. Right? <laughs> <laughs> you know what's funny is like, I have to ask the show, like, are we supposed to know he's evil yet? Because <laughs> he's so clearly evil. Can you dispose of this? Make sure it doesn't get. Can you dispose of it? Oh yes, so I can. Yeah. This stuff could really ruin someone's life. Yeah. Oh, he said it could ruin someone's life. Well, no. Come on. He's gonna do is he right? His, is he gonna use it right in his office, or is he gonna wait till he gets to the? Co oh, she's gonna walk in on him using it. Doctor Rhyme. Agent Pennyworth. How Wait, did you say Dr. Rhyme is here? You can walk Rhyme? fine. Why do you carry that staff? You seem to be it, able to walk fine. Symbolic, Greg's. It means Enigma. Do you mind if I ask what we discussed? Perhaps we should discuss it in private. So Enigma erased her memory because they discussed something yeah. super spe. Wouldn't you be like terrified to be alone in a room with her? Mm -hmm. Well, this is all being recorded in here, right? Well, everything well. should be recorded in here. <laughs> that you looks so awkward. Leave. What did you do to me? Same thing I'm about to do. Yeah. Wow. Make Fucking idiot. You you That's are so you are cloud. so stupid. God that damn it. Really, really painful having that in your leg. What a weird syringe placement yeah. thingy. How do you get out of here? Are you how God. are there places not How can you do this? 
So how is she not going to know? How is HQ the place her leg. to go to get away with anything you want to get away giant with? giant hole in her she, leg. What she did was the only way that person was able to get away yeah. with this. Like, if she had done anything yeah. else. God, I hate Penny Dick. Tell me. How much money does he I don't know. Oh, this is the prison commissioner man, right? He's out so here alone at night. Couple, all that money means you'll be willing to do anything yeah. to keep yourselves filled. Oh, hey. That's why you yeah, you tell him, Batwoman, you paragon of virtue. Any programs that kept at-risk kids from ending up in one yeah, of you're your short. prisons? You can't possibly prove this, though. All right, you got me. Oh, unless it's just that. So you're confessing? More like stalling. Oh, Zappy Man's about to turn up, I guess. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wait, so does his gun sap the electricity in the area? They probably just thought, oh, electricity, it's gonna do things. Well, they hit her before, they'll just hit her again, right? Because... Oh, there's lots of them. Okay. Well, well if she I mean, stands next to the commissioner guy, be. they won't shoot, right? Oh. Are they all gonna hit him at once? Oh, they're gonna cut away. I'm curious. I wonder what's happening. What are we doing now? Who is this? What's this? What the hell is going on? <laughs> what's well, happening? Arrest those people. They're arresting the uh, the bad guys, right? I like to remind everybody that Sophie had a husband at one point. <laughs> yeah. <That> was, <laughs> Remember that, was... that guy? <laughs> all right, they're out there dead. <laughs> Why would they decide to have activated those. Yeah, you think you would have just seen them without the... Uh, yeah, you could see them. Man is done. No! I feel like with this organization, he just like wouldn't work for them, because they kill their own people <laughs> they, they constantly. Keep, they, they don't just kill their own people, they kill all of them. Oh, no, people. they missed all of their shots. Wait, what? Do you oh, think it one of them it. shots the is going to hit the, uh, the guy in charge of the... Oh, how did you oh. get so close? Oh, my wow. God. This is incredible. Oh, it's raining no, in just this shot. Away. Is it going to not be raining in the next one? Yeah, it's not raining. <laughs> yeah, just Oh, wow. Her. I guess she forgot there was one. Oh, yeah, what an idiot. Dead. Yeah, she's done, yeah. Keep Fire. keep shooting, guys. Keep shooting. Wow. Is this the reporter man? Uh -huh. Gazette man? It shoots... It splits oh. into three beams. Oh, Jacob! Oh, no. It's Luke. Luke. Oh, look, Jacob. What the hell? What's going on in my brain? <laughs> Also, it split into three beams and attacked all the people he needed it, it to. It split into three beams? Wow. So Batwoman's been saved at the last second twice in a row now? Ah, stop cutting. Wow, Batwoman sucks. All this footage you got with your drone, I don't care. Uh, stop cutting Ow. so much. I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, why are you doing this? Stop, Jesus. Oh my. Why? I can't focus on anything. I just know it's a oh, city. I, that's that all hurt. I know. That's all my brain can piece together. Oh, in the fuck off, Alice. Actors. No, we need no. the payoff of this uh, Is this Skin Man's office? No, this is, what is this? this? Enigma. How did she get here? Is there no security? Of course there's yeah. no one yeah. has security unless they need to for plot. Oh, I wonder if this will be the exact place she needs it to be. That's why I can't shake this church for another Yep, person. literally the exact place yep. she needs it to be. Yep, yep. yeah. Do. <laughs> Not an hour goes by when I don't think about it. Are they really trying to redo their relationship too? <laughs> like, guys, give us a chance. Those two care about each other, okay? Forgetting Z's here. Okay. Erasing data. So just say it again. But you still remember it because it was said to you. No, she'll give her a forget me thing. It'll be great. I'm just glad you got your job back. And I hear a big promotion. So you're allowed to operate the clinic? No, nah, just doing it anyway. She has her out. She has her lab coat. I don't understand. <gasps> lab coat. <gasps> Yay! Your apartment. Shut her down. Uh, but he's gonna repair the relationship by letting her do it. I don't care what you have to say. I'm opening the place back up. So if you want to start, illegal. You can't. You don't have a license. I want to help you make this place a real clinic. Hire real doctors. I'll even pay for it. What possible objection could you have to making this place legit? Because it goes against the very reason I started the clinic, okay? I don't ask for ID. I don't require insurance. I don't report ODs or nonviolent criminal behavior. You don't report ODs. You don't but that's true. But if you also, also nonviolent criminal behavior, yeah. that involves a lot of serious crimes still. Yeah. And like Franny said, what if you kill someone? What if someone gets sick? What What's if there's there? malpractice? What if you fuck up? I don't think she understands. What if you didn't diagnose someone? You should take his offer because the alternative is you go to prison. I can make a difference in this crappy city, and you want to take that away from me. And for that, I will never forgive oh, you. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you, yeah. You fucking cunt. He just Poor gave Jacob. you the greatest offer of your entire fucking existence. Wow. Yeah. I'm going to make you, he like, legitimate. I'm not going to take it away from you. I'm going to bring in real doctors. Yeah, he even said he'd pay for all of it. Oh, fucking God. hell. Wow. <laughs> fuck, Mary. What an absolute piece of shit. Jacob's just getting stepped on. 
the poor guy. Yeah. Now he's just gonna want to take more drugs. He will. That's what the end of the episode will be. Because she's just made him even sadder now. Take care, love. Oh, I'm just leaving town. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> but what about that thing where you forgot where you yeah, went? Yeah, you might like, want to. Uh... I'm glad the place is getting some good press. Yeah, the phones have been lighting up with donations and volunteers. Yeah, that makes I sense. I figured that would happen. Everything just chance. worked out, yeah. yeah. The DA signed off on Angelique Steele. The WITSEC team is moving her into protective custody as we speak. Thank you. No, thank you for getting her to talk. Ugh. Yeah, Ryan. Until we can you're take down yeah, yeah. so you're awesome. the greatest. Be off you're the, the most wonderful person <clears throat> ever. Well you were we always right. I can't believe someone doubted you ever. Well, here we are. Yeah, he's gonna take the thing. Yep. <laughs> yeah. yep. Dude, I would recommend Why taking this. Why would you do it here? Don't do it here, worst, dude. Like... Like... <laughs> who's gonna walk in? Who's it gonna be who walks yeah, who's in? Gonna walk in? Because he wouldn't uh... lock his door. Because that'd be crazy. Or do you think Come he's gonna on. not do it? You don't or... have to do it, man. Jacob, Come on. Ducks. You don't have to do this, Jacob. No. No. Oh, it's going in. No. Oh, he tuned it. Well, I guess they got nothing else to do for Jacob. So this is gonna mm -hmm. be it now. Gave my daughter everything she ever wanted and she spat back in my face and called me a piece of shit. So now I have to turn to drugs so that I can pretend that I rescued a daughter. I just like like okay. Jesus Christ, what a what a Oh what a, she's gonna get attacked. She's what a gonna sad get attacked. existence. Oh yeah. Her. Dude, the fact that they're showing this means she's doomed. But now that I do Yeah, car's gonna I pull up say... and Thank you. Yeah. Yep, it is. you can hear it. Yeah. Oh no. Let's see how incompetent these cops are. There you go. Wow. They're very wow. Oh. Wow. Okay. They're just dead. That's that. Just oh, shoot her. No, nah, Black shooter. Mask will want to kill her Your with guns. a giant saw. <laughs> Music. Yeah, it's a little bit off, isn't it? Also, his mask. <laughs> That's, That's hilarious. hilarious. John Pelican. Man, the crows really are fucking worthless. Yep. Well, we wouldn't want them to be out of character, would we? If they did something sure even bad. remotely competent, we would wonder why uh, the writers came. Uh, yeah, my main thought about all of this was just, I just feel sad for Jacob. He's just being yeah. stabbed yeah. on. What a yeah. horrible existence he's had, and everyone hates him, and he only does the right things. It's like, you know what, man? <sighs> I did shut you down, but... I'm thinking now, because it is just something that's really good, I'm gonna get you some doctors, we're gonna officialize it, get you all the materials and requirements you need, and she's like, yeah, but then people will have to have insurance to be able to get the medical attention they need. Like, well, oh. why do we pay paying for insurance? Uh, because, like, shut up. What's yeah. just, what happens if you kill someone? Because you didn't yeah, even finish it, med school. Well, no, like, well, remember? I, I never kill anybody. Rem I get what was rule right. two? What was rule two of the bat team? Was uh, accountability. accountability, yeah. <laughs> accountability. And you don't, <laughs> you don't, you don't have any accountability if you fuck up. If you give someone the wrong dose, if you misdiagnose, if you do anything wrong, like that's one of the big things that hospitals have to deal with is lawsuits and the legal stuff when it comes to you know yeah. malpractice and errors and stuff like that now in this show mary's fucking perfect even though she doesn't even have a degree yet she's just smarter than anyone else ever and she's brilliant and she never ever makes any mistakes so i guess she doesn't have to worry about it but realistically yeah there's there's no well, if someone overdoses on something or uh, what if you don't have the tools you need here? what if you don't have their Where full medical background and you give them something that fucking kills them yeah yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, and they deal with all kinds of crazy injuries as well, like getting yeah, hit by like a shotgun. Not, not like getting flu. Yeah. This show has such a simplistic take on the world that private prisons let prisoners <laughs> out to fucking destroy <laughs> community centers <laughs> to so get more prisoners. Go to prison. And then, like, oh, we'll see, I gotta open up an illegal, unregulated medical clinic because insurance, <laughs> like, makes it hard for people to get it. But, like, I don't make any mistakes, so it's fine. It's all but these see, it's okay. simplistic, stupid statements but, about how the world but works. Fringy, for the writing, if you wanna, like, we wanna, oh, it's people have insurance it's totally bad that people have insurance instead of like explaining why uh, maybe medical insurance is you know something that is good to have and maybe you should pay it and you know maybe there's ups and downs to it and things like and actually instead of having a nuanced discussion about these sorts of things just invent an underground clinic that always takes care of people who always gets it right run by a doctor who's never wrong and who is portrayed as always being correct and boom yeah see people don't that's, need insurance yeah look that's, at my clinic that's the problem with this show is that it gets gets in its own way by me like there is something to be said about community centers and like programs that just give people something to do and and like whether that has an effect on reducing yeah, crime there's something to be said about that and similarly mm -hmm. there's something to be said about whether there are institutional blockers that make it hard for people to access the medical system in the united states these are all worth exploring but you completely 
Like, you are not helping by boiling it down to this incredibly simplistic and stupid, like, interpretation of the way that the world works. And every time there's a compromise offered, like what Jacob says, it's like, this is, this is a step. It's like spat on. Like, the fact she said, I will yeah. never forgive you. It's like, go fuck yourself. He stopped you from going to prison. What? Yeah. You, but, why yeah, do you- Yeah, in, in the whole- it's, They never it's discuss like the, why what she's it, trying to do is illegal. It's like, do you know why? Do you actually exactly. know why? Or do you think it's just because evil people saying no? Yeah, it's, it's like private prisons. Are we going to have a discussion on maybe they exist because there are benefits to private prisons? Or are we just going to say, no, they're just evil. They're just cartoonishly yeah, like, and, and that's Yeah, that's another one. Like, there's a conversation to be had about the role of private prisons in society, but you're not helping by saying they are evil. Like, that's it. There is no benefit or utility to them at all. They are strictly evil and bad. This is just really <laughs> shallow. It's so shallow. The whole thing is. Jacob just makes only the right decisions, and now because he's incredibly weakened by everything that's happened, and he was assaulted with a fucking injection, he's gonna become a junkie, and then Batwoman yeah. will save him from tumbling down into yeah. a horrible life. And then I she'll actually, take over the clothes, maybe. I just, I just <laughs> looked up some things. Did you know that private prisons, released inmates have lower re offense rates coming out of private prison that's interesting i don't know enough about private yeah, would, prisons uh, to like there'd be so much to go into yeah, to I figure just, out it was thing. the show doesn't do any of that yeah here's the thing the, the show isn't mature enough to start a conversation without taking a side it's like star trek where you have two characters who are on opposite sides of a discussion and they both give their points or you have a show where you have two different characters. One takes position A, one takes position B, and they, they both give a couple points, and the show is careful to kind of equalize the points that they give so it doesn't appear to be super one-sided. And the issue isn't resolved in that episode, or there's no true resolution on who's totally correct, but they learn that, oh, maybe the truth is somewhere, you know, maybe we don't have to go all the way on one side, or maybe there's actually a discussion that we could start here in the episode and people can learn about later. This show is just, we just want to preach to people about what we say is correct, and we're not even, and we're definitely not going to give it a fair discussion. We're not going to talk about it in a way that's reasonable. It's just, this is just, but private prisons are evil, and they're bad, and they're horrible. And off-license hospitals are incredibly altruistic and good. Yes, yes because, they're amazing. You know, if you were mm -hmm. ill, if you were ill, you would go to one of the, like, healthcare is, oh, Jesus Christ, so, yeah. It's I can't, very I can't, expensive. I can't, I can't deal it's with it. Very it's very complex. Like, it's, 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 you can't just invent a superwoman who's never wrong ever to always do the right medical thing at all times, mm -hmm. who the, you write to be perfect. It's insane and then because have the message be, yeah. she's shunting uh, Jacob and it's like, woman, he's going to stop you again <laughs> like because that's the well is, he won't really... because he doesn't want to now probably and that's enough and especially with his junkiness but the message junkiness. is so weird surely the way to fix a lot of these problems is to fix them institutionally rather than beyond the institutions that exist not to mention um, how does that fix anything what would be a more interesting plot line is if he does officialize it and she brings in some doctors and some of them are willing to like let some things slide here and there insurance wise and maybe Mm -hmm. You know, her illegal activity goes from being completely off the books to she just tries to get some people through the system where they wouldn't be able to normally. Like yeah, that. a more realistic and interesting but Way more interesting. Yeah, and you know, Jacob slowly catches up on it and he's like, you can't keep doing this. And she's like, I have and to she, keep doing this. She has to make difficult choices on who she can let slide because she can't yeah. let everybody slide. Have some actual moral dilemmas like who, who deserves more of a chance. And then, and then from there, you can like make that a thing of, hmm, maybe this is something to think about in the real world in terms of just these sort of issues. But no, it's because there's nothing to think about right. when you say, yeah. you know what? I reckon the good things should happen and bad things shouldn't. And you're like, all right, yeah, like thanks. That's it's that's do awesome. better. It is do better. It's but the real do world, better. It's, it's just not that simple. It, the real world life is complicated and confusing and difficult. Batwoman. <laughs> <laughs> Bat, mm -hmm. well, that, yeah, that's Batwoman. That's the that's the incredible mm. top tier commentary you get from Batwoman. Cops are bad, crows are bad, private prisons are bad. The healthcare system illegal is clinics bad. are good. Everyone is gay. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone's gay. Huh. What a journey. Join us next yes. time for episode twelve. Who knows? No, it's eleven. What will happen? Oh, eleven. Yeah, yeah. we're catching up. You this show fool. definitely doesn't disappoint in terms of its awfulness. I'm sure it'll be great. There was a time there was a time when we worried that the show might get better after the first yeah. season and we would have less to talk about, but the show's worse. It's yeah, getting it's worse. more blatantly preachy. The plots are m less sensical. And I do stand by. I think that um Ryan's she's a superior actor. 
but she's just so insufferable. I miss Kate. Uh, yeah, she's she's still really bad, but she's better than Ruby Rose. But her badness is not as entertaining. No, she yeah. comes across as a self righteous cunt. I really enjoyed. Uh, and they write Ruby her to Rose. be that, so I enjoyed you know, Ruby she, Rose as well. <laughs> she was very yeah. funny. <laughs> Uh, she's gonna get replaced by someone else. Ryan's got the really not gonna be as funny. Like Ryan is consistently wrong and yet one hundred percent up her own ass about how right she is. It's really Which annoying. is like Kate Kane, but Kate Kane was much more entertaining when it happened. Yeah. And Ryan, I feel like they just take it a step further. Where you even have she has to school the team at the end with her transparent marker board to tell them that it's like, how dare you even doubt me when I let criminals be criminals? Very oof, very preachy and self-righteous join us next time uh, join yeah, us yeah, our next, next adventures next great time mm, bye mm. see ya